In this movie, I'm going to address the question, is this training series right for you? The reason why I'm addressing this question is because the After Effects crowd tends to be a more advanced crowd. And when After Effects CS3 Essential Training came out, people were frustrated at first because the training series started so basic and simple. But that's exactly what this training series is designed to do. In this training series, we're going to start from scratch. As we'll talk about in the next movie, there are other programs like Photoshop and Illustrator that I'll mention frequently, but I'm not going to assume that you know how to use them. For those of you that are familiar with After Effects, feel free to skip ahead a few chapters and skip the basics you already know. Now, when I was creating this training, I kept in mind that there are many different users of After Effects. There are motion graphics artists, and there are people that just do compositing. There are people that just do video for the web. And so I prepared this training with all of you in mind. So if you're using After Effects for the internet or for creating video for cell phones or for broadcast, whatever, the bases are covered here. As I mentioned, we're going to talk next about using After Effects with other programs. This is a really important part of using After Effects well, so let's go check that out.